I check we back with Clarence and George, this is the guy that works for me, is here. And he said, Well, how's he around dogs? Oh, he couldn't get anybody worse. If you tell him not to, it's almost impossible. I'm, I'm understanding. People cannot keep their hands off a dog. They can't keep their hands off him. If you said, What about Skylar? Oh, he's all over Skylar. So I'm just going to use this. If you said, Well, this is going to cause. If you said, Why is that so red like that? There's that much iron in there, in the water, I guess. If you said, that's why it is, that's why it's red, unless it's like some kind of red algae. Anyway, if you said, well, the dog's going to see this distraction and take off, probably, <laughs> that's what they do. Oh, look, boxes got delivered, too. Thank God George is here. If you said, it looks like he just got up. Yeah, I'm sure he did. Yeah, I'm sure he did. If you said, what's the chance of George saying something inappropriate? Oh, hi, Vic. Oh, it's real high. George doesn't have emotional intelligence. If you said, neither do you. I have some. I have some. I have selective emotional intelligence. George doesn't have any. So if you said, what's going to happen? Yeah, if I had to guess, this dog's going to say, oh, new person. You're yesterday's news. See you, lady. If you said, what, what's... What do you have to be able to do? I have to make something happen over there. I have to exist over there via the pager. George, I think we should go back. Oh, look, he found the phone. Yay! Yay! <laughs> you know, I want to go. I'm, I'm now sort of like I was the type that had like a lot of the silver fillings. You know how like back in the day they would put those mercury fillings in your teeth. I systemically went to the dentist and got all my silk. What? You're fine. I systemically went and got all my silver fillings replaced with white enamel or whatever the crap they use now. If you said, oh, they figured out that stuff was bad too. Crap. I have to go get those all replaced. <laughs> but I'm going to get rid of all my regular lighting and get LED lights because that's what I like. That's the kind of lighting I like. Anyway, I'm going to have to go to Lowe's to get this. So if he says this dog going to run over there, oh, it's going to have some reaction. Why wouldn't it? Look at him, look at him. He said he's cowardly. Oh, George, you left your hammer here the other day, too. He said, oh, he's getting ready to run. Clarence! Okay, um, I think that we should, if, if that one works out, uh, let's just run back. That, that thing wasn't expensive, was it? Yeah, 70 bucks. That thing was 70 bucks? Yes. No, well, was 50, no, 59, the flat panel one was 79. The one I was looking at for the bathroom was 79. It was pretty expensive, but it was it's nice. It's not that expensive. It's going to last and make a cheaper electric bill. Yeah, like 500000 luminance. Oh, no, I thought that that was just like some $20 thing. No, no, no. Okay, no. all right, go start working on it. But if that works, I want to maybe replace... Listen to me, George. We need to bring this kennel crate needs to be brought inside for one thing. i got to put that Rottweiler in it. It's trying to get those little puppies. Uh-oh. Oh, when they get bigger, it'll be fine, but i got to get it in that crate. Yeah. So we need to do that, but it needs to be rinsed off. All right, the light is still sitting there. Have you got all everything you need? Yeah, yeah. Well, what, where's your tools? I'll get my tools. I'll get my tools. Okay. Anyway, that was a good distraction, and I told you. George can't even keep his hands off Skyler. He's all over the dog. So 
if you said now what? Well, he already found the phone on his own, so I must be getting somewhere with my deliver to hand. And, you know, you've got to go on faith. If I just stood there and tried to call the dog away, I was more interesting in some ways because I was in motion. They can't help themselves. Gonna have to go in there in a minute because George is gonna get all these dogs barking. Clarence! All right, so just let me work on my deliver to hand a little bit. George says that is a distraction. It is. Yeah, little red dog. Looks an awful lot like a goblin. In his face. Red one. Oh, brown, red. red oh red. no, it looks like a total. All right, so his new name is Angle Goblin. That's how I got the dog. George has adopted it to these people in their 80s, and the man was trying to take it for a walk. It was biting his feet. Angle Goblin. Can you see some 80-year-old man trying to walk this thing, George, on a flexi leash while I was biting his feet? <laughs> if you said it was a bad match, oh, it was a bad oh, match. <laughs> he actually found that on his own. We've worked on the deliver. We've worked on, he didn't jump on George when he walked back by the second time. We want to start getting him a default down. I just haven't done it yet because I was working on the deliver, but. <laughs> You've got to be pretty good at sports with this one, Chuck. So, if you said, okay, well, what about the pulling? Yeah, what about the pulling? So, if you said, well, what about the pulling? You just have to structure. You've got to let the dog hit the end of the leash. If the dog is pulling to get to the end of the leash, let it get there. Let it get there. It's got to know what's going to happen if you keep stopping it from going there. It's going to still keep wanting to go there. If it knows what's there, 
If it knows it's the edge of the envelope, then it knows what's out there. It's not gonna keep pulling. <laughs> because this dog presented as an extreme puller. So if you said, what do you need? I do need a distraction. Yay. All right, so he already gives me the shake off. And this dog again presented wearing a harness and is an extreme puller. So that's all handler error. All I've got to do is travel north and south or east and west. Because of the way the driveway is, I'll be going east and west. See how loose the leash is. All right, George, start walking this way. I need you to be a distraction. You're just going directly towards the distraction. I'll show you this other light I want to change, and I'll just run up there, use that stupid credit thing, and get a couple more if it's pretty fast to do. Am I wrong? Let's see how fast it goes. Oh, hi, Linda. Let's see how fast it goes with him installing this giant LED light. If you said that's what... He goes, oh, it'll be real bright. Okay, I'm putting blackout curtains on the windows and everything else. He must have some sense. It looks like it dark. I guess I could turn it on if I needed to. Anyway, so that's where we're at. Let me go make sure that he's not in there sticking his fingers in the cages. Um, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to run to Lowe's. I'm just going to replace all my whatever kind of lighting I have that they put in this house when I had it built 10 years ago. Replace it with LED lights because that's what I like. <laughs> they change colors and every other thing. Not just like regular lights. I don't. I never like those fluorescent lights. Those ones with those fluorescent bulbs. So 1920, you know, and they were just like make little noises and stuff. But you said you liked that. No, God, I didn't like that at all. What the hell is that? Anyway, be right back. 